Good morning everybody. Today is the day we are finally heading to Japan. However, we just have to do a nutso flight, so uh, let the first 10 hour journey begin. <laughs> we never usually do this, but we try to play the honeymoon card to get an upgrade to business class. It didn't work. <laughs> One day we will fly business. One day. <laughs> One day. <laughs> Thank you so much. Bobby, let's do it. Oh, thank you so much. Good. Oh Isn't that good upstairs? This is nice. I know, we've never flown any hat. I'm super impressed. Sorry guys, we don't have window seats, but... You gotta look at me. Um, just make yourself at home, buddy. Socks on, shoes off, blankets. Is ready? It's a 10 hour flight, this one. Is it? Is seven, seven hours, hour the next flight? one's 10 hours. Let's get three cheap. Seven hours later. Hi, thank you. Welcome to Abu Dhabi, everyone. It is like 9 o'clock and you just don't realise how much flying just takes up your entire day. First time we've ever flown Etihad. I was super impressed. I think just if you fly any of the Arabic airlines, you're good. Like Emirates, Etihad, tick of approval. Alrighty. 10 hours. <laughs> we'll see you guys soon. We'll see you at meal time. <laughs> this has been our life for the last 24 hours. You guys in Tokyo. Thank you. Welcome to Japan, everybody! <laughs> After traveling for 24 hours, I don't know how I have any sort of energy, but let's go get our bags and make our way towards our hotel. Oh, I'm so excited. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much. Alrighty guys, we just got out of immigration and we're just trying to figure out how to get in and we've realized that it is so much cheaper to just catch the train in. Taxis are about two to three hundred US dollars to get in so don't even think about catching the taxi in. But we have to go buy a SIM card because Google offline and here maps offline just isn't working here. I don't know why. But we got a SIM card for about 3,500 yen which was about $40 for two gigabytes for eight days so it's not going to cover our entire time here. Expensive. It is expensive, but we needed to at least get around Tokyo. Here's challenge here. We always call Jess the Metro Queen. For some reason she's really good at trains, terrible directions, but this is going to be her biggest test yet. This is her brain working right now. <laughs> she has found the ticket counter. Oh yeah, that's what Japanese money looks like, guys. <laughs> this ticket was about 1300 yen, so about $15 to get us into the city for like an hour. I love how the family mart is just a vending machine. <laughs> Welcome to Tokyo everybody! We wanted the full Tokyo experience so we booked some uh, some unique accommodation for the night. We're actually staying at one of the capsule hotels and uh, I don't even know what to expect. But this is where we are. Staying at the prime part just here. Females and males are not allowed to sleep together so there's like separate quarters for Jess and for me. <laughs> I'm gonna be alone! Checking super nice. So we have a little elevator. And they're giving us like a little thank you so much. Thank you. <laughs> so they're giving us a little key card. On. You go floor and then I'll go. Okay. Women's floor, men's floor. They're giving us some like. Oh yeah, they gave us some slippers. <laughs> <laughs> bye bye, Jess. Bye. <laughs> I see they've got like a luggage storage for you because you guys don't know about the capsule hotels. They're called capsule hotels for a reason. There is like no space in these places, but that's all about the experience. So I'm either room or pod 1233, three, and I think we need to take our shoes off. That's probably why they've given us the slippers.
can come over here see that my room is this one up here we have a bit of a view right in front of me so I thought I'd give you guys a bit of a room tour of my uh, very spacious apartment for the night so this is me 133 <laughs> this is so cool this is it this is the spot where I'm gonna be staying I see they've given us a bit of a package I have a toothbrush a hand towel a normal towel and they've even given us pajamas which I think is so cool there's a bit of storage for some bags, for some personal bags. I've got a TV here, so I can actually watch TV in bed. Oh, they've even given us some headphones, which is nice. Got some hangers, put some clothes up for the morning. And they've given us like a little bit of a control station here. I don't know what this is. Oh, lights. We've got lights. We've got a night mode. I don't know what you do because some headphones is probably so I can listen to the TV some charging stations so that's the port they have here I'm not sure if we have a charger here some free Wi-Fi and yeah <sighs> this is our room <laughs> I think this is so fascinating so a lot of people the reason these are so popular here in Tokyo is because a lot of businesses businessmen will either work late or they'll go out drinking and then they have like a cheap spot just to stay but we're doing it because this is all part of the experience. I am loving this. <laughs> and then they have like hostel style separate male and female toilets and stuff. What just happened? This one's feeling the jet lag a little bit. <laughs> How's your room? I think they're identical, aren't they? They are identical. I try to film in there, but there were so many girls sleeping and it's, there's all these signs saying you need to be really quiet. But I'm guessing ours is identical, right? This is my little capsule. Go up. Oh my god, this is really cool. <laughs> it definitely has um coffin vibes, I would say. Um, did they yes, give you pajamas? They did, yeah. It's so cool, hey? Pajamas? I, I haven't even looked in the showers or anything yet. I just dumped our stuff, but we're gonna go and have some dinner now and then probably go to bed because I need to get over this jet lag. But hopefully we can find a cool place to eat. Oh I had an experience need... in the bathroom before. Uh -huh. You just wait till you see it. <laughs> see, we need to find ramen. Oh no. I wanna have our first meal as ramen. Guys, we've done our first touristy mistake. We brought the wrong adapter. So nothing can be charged at the moment. So we're gonna go and try and find an electronics store somewhere. Fingers crossed they sell like a universal adapter for us. But we're currently walking down the street. Super busy, unfortunately. Weather isn't in favor of us today, but that's hey, okay. At least it's not raining. That is true. Alrighty, we found it. It's a place called Ipudo and it does ramen. Two. 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 So the kitchen's right there. We've got a menu. Steve, I need to select your hardness of your noodles. Okay. So you do your normal, firm, very firm, or quick boil. Mmm, normal? Have, they even have names for it. So do you want like vegetable? Vegetable, egg sounds good, mushroom sounds good. Okay. Just everything. Okay. And they've given us some, we have to try it. What is it? I don't know what it is. You just gonna, <laughs> do you reckon it's apple juice? It's tea. Oh, it's tea. It's like iced tea. Yeah. Oh, that looks so good. How are you gonna finish that? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Our first ever ramen in, come on, in the Japan. Most authentic, cutest little place we just saw on the streets as well. Oh, it looks hot, Bobby. Come on, Steve. Dig in. It's been so long since I've used chopsticks. Oh, ramen. <laughs> oh, ramen coma. I am in. Combine that with the jet lag, and I am ready to hit the hay. I just put on the jammies they gave us. It's so cute. I have to show you how nice the showers are. I was so impressed. They're in here. Let's make sure no one's in here. 
They give you like a full on area to hang your stuff, a little basket. When you come through here, there's like shampoo, conditioner, shower gel, and even like face wash and stuff. They're really nice. I need to check out these cool toilets that Steve was talking about. <gasps> oh my god. <gasps> oh, the buttons. Oh my gosh, I'm scared. Alrighty, back the pod. And I didn't realize that it is actually full on pajama jams. I thought it was just going to be like a robe or something like that. But sorry guys that this Tokyo vlog is so short running on zero fuel and traveling for the last 20 hours i'm so surprised we actually managed to get out of the capsule but i think i'm gonna find if there's anything interesting on here to watch gotta see if there's some some cool japanese tv that's on there's no volume because we have to have to put the headphones in so i probably have to keep my voice down a bit but i need to find the pokemon channel i'm just putting it out there there we go yes this is my night sorted <laughs> Probably not going to understand a word they're saying. A little boxes on the hillside. A little boxes, little ticky tacky, little 